Hello everybody, today in this video I'm going to show you how you can download VMware Workstation Pro for free. So let's get started. So first go to Google here, type here VMware, download, and hit and enter and you need to click on this VMware official website which is like desktop hypervisor solution. So click that and you will need to click on this download fusion or workstation. This will redirect you guys to broadcom.com. So you need to log in with your username and password, but if you don't have, you can simply log in here and click on register the Broadcom account for you. Now input your email address and now fill out this captcha and click on next. Now go to your Gmail, then we need to copy this verification code and verify and continue. Now fill up your name, all right, and also make sure to select your country. You can put any anything on job title, re-enter the password and click on I accept and create an account all right so we have created this account now go back to the uh, broadcom login page and just enter your username and password here now input your password then this will take you to your broadcom dashboard so as you guys can see that in my download there is nothing at all so you need to click on my dashboard so you guys will need to search here on search entire site type here vmware work station and you need to select this pro instead of player or workstation now click on this link and it will redirect you guys to download page so from here you will need to scroll down and you will see here a reference uh, section here so this is where you guys will need to click this is for windows and the fusion here is for uh, macintosh so if you guys wanted to download for mac then you need to click here so if you are on windows simply click this one all right so just click that now make sure to select for the operating system that you guys are using so this is for windows so i will select this one here uh, vmware workstation pro and the latest version 17.2 then simply click on this uh, download button so people will end up uh, getting this error as you guys can see in the left corner there is an error message saying account pending all right the verification is pending right now and you will need to wait for like a moment maybe two hour or three hour if it doesn't work for you there is an alternate solution for you as well so don't lose hope all right so just try the alternate solution that i'm going to provide you it should work fine for you as well all right guys so for me this website didn't ask me any kind of account verification stuff right now but it was asking me uh, an account verification just like hour ago so i waited for hour and now i am able to download this as you guys can see that it just uh, execute the download you can see there your download has started so you need to wait for maybe two or four hours i don't know it's up to the broadcom website so i'm downloading right now and I also have the alternative solution for you. Uh, in case if he doesn't um, validate or verify your account, you need to go to this website. I will link this down in the description. And you need to click on this VMW desktop. Go to WS if you guys are using Windows. Fusion is for Mac as I already told you that. So WS, scroll down. And make sure to click on 17.2. Go to this folder or 2400 whatever so click on windows or linux so i'm on windows and click on core and this is a download um this is the file that you guys will need to download this is the tar file it's basically like winmar you know you can extract this on your computer and install directly this is an executable file for you all right so it's going to be a same process after you download this so once you guys have download, you know, or an extract from that tar file. Now go to download folder and right click and open this file and click on yes. And it should start the workstation installation and click on next. I accept, click on next and make sure to uncheck this CEIP because you don't want to do that. All right, so just go ahead and click on next and install. And also you can see that I have also downloaded the tar file because my account was not been validating on the server. I don't know what's going on. So I, I tried this method which definitely work. I also installed this. It does work super fine. You can also use personal license in this. 
all right so we have finished the installation now open up the vmware all right so now it's working perfectly fine so since i have used the uh, personal license when it showed me uh, if you wanted to enter the license or if you guys wanted to enter public or personal use so i choose personal use now it's been like a personal license for me so you can also see on this about workstation this is how it looked like so yeah this is how you guys can download uh, vmware 17 for free using broadcom thank you so much for watching see you guys in the next video peace